name is Dr. Judy Lynn Mitchell. You may call me Lady Read Along. Reading is so much fun. You get to use your imagination, learn new words, and see beautiful pictures. Let's see which book Bookie Lookie wants us to read today. Counting Bugs by Liza Charlesworth. Scholastic Books. Let's count bugs in my garden. Oh, isn't she cute? Oh, and she's got such beautiful, beautiful flowers around her. Hmm. I love this picture. I love flowers. One grasshopper hops. Do you see the grasshopper, boys and girls? And you see the little girl with her pretty smile? She's got a beautiful smile like you, bookie looky. Oh, the flowers are beautiful. Let's turn the page. Two butterflies flutter, flutter. Oh, look at the butterflies. Oh, she looks so happy. And she's smiling as they fly over her head. All oh, this beautiful. And look, she even has flowers on her dress. Three worms wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Oh, look at the worms. One, two, three. Okay, and the little girl is playing, it looks like, with one of the worms. But look at all of the beautiful, beautiful flowers in the back. Four ladybugs fly, fly, fly. Let's count the ladybugs. One, two, three, four. And she has her little hands up. Four ladybugs fly, 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 fly. <laughs> Five spiders creep, 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 creep. Ooh, look at the spiders. Mm, she's just looking. She is not touching the spiders. Five spiders creep, 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 creep. One, two, three, four, five. Let's turn the page and see what else the little girl discovers. Oh, she says, but none of them makes a little peep. Oh, she's like, shh. And it looks like all of the little bugs are not saying a word. They're just enjoying the flowers with the little girl. Did you like that story, boys and girls? Ah, Lady Read Along did. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Parents, thank you so very much for joining us on Pack 14. Here's some reading tips. another story. Surprise! Okay. Surprises by Liza Charlesworth. Oh my. Let's turn the page so we can find out surprises by Lisa Charlesworth and see what's in these boxes. Can you guess what is in this big box? Hmm, big box. And it's blue. And the little girl's thinking about it. Oh, surprise! It's a computer! And look at the little girl. <laughs> She's typing away. Okay. 
Let's turn the page and see other surprises. Can you guess what is in this very big box? Hmm. Hmm. Can you guess, Prentice? Can you guess? Washington? Can you guess? Oh, Frederick! Frederick! You smart. Tell me. Oh, you're right. Surprise! It's a bike. It's a bike. Look at the bicycle. Oh, that's wonderful. Can you ride a bicycle, Bookie Lookie? <laughs> okay, we'll have to show the boys and girls a little bit later. Can you guess what is in this very, very big box? Mm, it's bigger than the little girl. Oh, <laughs> surprise! <laughs> it's an elephant! Oh my goodness, you must use your imagination. Can you put an elephant in a box? No, but the picture is adorable. <laughs> and the little girl is so happy. Oh, that's wonderful. Oh, let's turn the page. Let's turn the page. Wow! This is just what I wanted. Hmm, so what did she want? You're right. You're right, Kate. She wanted an elephant. <laughs> Don't go anywhere, boys and girls. We have some more reading tips. Lady, read along. And Bookie Lookie will be right back. Coming back, our next book is titled This Little Piggy mm, by Liza Charlesworth. Oh, let's count the little piggies. Mm, mm, you remember my, <laughs> my verbal pig? Let's count the piggies. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, let's see what the little piggies are going to do. By Liza Charlesworth. Scholastic Books. This little piggy went out shopping. Mm -hmm. oh, I like the way the little piggy seems to be so happy shopping. <laughs> These bags are filled with all kinds of things. She has a little purse. This little piggy met a bear. Oh, we have a bear too. Yeah, we've got a bear. This little piggy met a bear and they're shaking hands. This little piggy ate some popcorn. Mmm, look at that popcorn. Yummy, yummy. This little piggy curled her hair. Oh, she is so cute. And she's reading a book while wow. she's getting her hair curled. Let's turn the page. And this little piggy went Because she's swinging in the swing. She's swinging on the swing. Up in the air. Wee! Wee! <coughs> Having so much fun. Did you like that story about the piggies? Oh, I loved it. It was adorable. Don't go. Don't go. We'll be right back. Other book, Lunch Crunch.
Look at that little girl and her tongue. Oh, she's hungry. She's hungry. And Michael, are you hungry, dear? Oh, yes, and Frederick and Quinn. Everybody wants to see what the little girl is going to eat. Lunch crunch. When I eat lunch, my crackers go crunch. <laughs> and look at that girl. She's got crackers. Oh, my. All different kinds of crackers in her paper bag. When I eat lunch, my carrots go crunch. Crunch. Oh, she looks so happy. So, so, so happy. When I eat lunch, my celery goes crunch. When I eat lunch, my chips go crunch. Oh, she's having a ball eating all of the food. Oh, Michael, Michael, I know you're enjoying this story. Frederick, yes, yes, yes. I know you're enjoying this story, too. Oh, Mary Lee, don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. Not at all. Oh, look, Michelle. When I eat lunch, oh, and it looks like she has a big, juicy, red apple. When I eat lunch, my apple goes crunch. When I eat lunch, my cookie goes crunch. Ah, oh, it's beautiful, beautiful. Maybe a chocolate chip cookie. I love it. Beautiful, tasty, wonderful. When I'm done with lunch, my bag goes crunch right into the trash can. What a delightful story. Boys and girls, I have enjoyed reading so very much. Thank you for joining me on Pack 14 Story Time. Okay, don't go anywhere. I love you. Bye-bye.